CBAI. Hey, what's up? This is Cam with CBAI. Thanks for tuning in. Have you been having problems with replacing your lyrics, having issues with the match lyrics to audio feature not showing up in your Suno editor, or just generally having problems with the replace lyrics function? Today I have a quick trick for you to hopefully get that all resolved. So join me today as we learn how to get around a grayed out match lyrics to audio feature and get some better lyric replacements. Let's jump in there. So let's say we're in your song editor and you're trying to use match lyrics to audio. And what this feature does, you should be using it if you're not already when you want to replace lyrics, is that it helps Suno's internal tracking mechanism line up where it's tracking your lyrics are actually at in the song. And then from there, you can, once this is done, once you've applied this, you will get more accurate replace lyrics down the road when you're using that feature. So it's very common. I've been hearing from lots of people that match lyrics to audio is grayed out. It's happening for me as well as of the right uh, recording of this video. So it's grayed out in the new editor. We can get around that by going into the legacy editor. So let's go over here to legacy editor. And then let's go over to the vertical ellipses and click on match lyrics to audio right here. Now you, depending on what, how, where you've been working in Suno, you might not have any lyrics here or they'll come across. Uh, so either copy paste in your lyrics or just put them in, make adjustments as needed. What we're doing here is you don't want to have your corrected lyrics yet. You want this to line up exactly to the way that the audio is in your track as it stands today, including the incorrect lyrics wherever they're at. Including also adding oohs and ahs wherever they're at in your song, that can help out as well. And then when you're done, click on confirm and align lyrics, and it's going to load and align them up to the way the song sounds. Then to check to make sure that everything did line up well, go through the song and watch here and you'll see something like uh, pink karaoke words highlighting. And then that's how you can check to see if the words are lining up pretty closely to where they're actually sounding in the audio of the song. So for example, if I click on verse two, you will see the words highlight in pink as the music goes along. So I'll show you. So it's highlighting those words and I'm seeing that they line up well. Go through the whole song and check that. If there's some sections that didn't line up well after you click confirm and align lyrics, make modifications as needed until they line up pretty closely. Do it again, confirm and align lyrics. Once that's all done, now we've matched the lyrics to the audio, we can do the replacements. Go back into the new editor by clicking on this vertical ellipses and clicking on new editor, which will pull up your edit session. From there, scroll to the part of the song that you want to do the changes in. So for example, maybe I want to change this spot. Highlight the section of the lyrics that you want to change like this. It will highlight that section in your audio as you can see here. Go to replace lyrics. It'll bring in the original lyrics, but maybe I will just want to put groove so neat or something like that. If you need to fix the alignment of your lyrics, if they're not lining up, click on this and then you can go and adjust it a little bit as needed using these pink slider bars. I'm not going to do that today. And then just go down and click replace. Now for the section that I've highlighted, I'm going to get my alternate version showing up here. Once your alternates have loaded, you can click through and hit play and demo each of them. So neat. And then if you find one that you like, you would simply uh, click commit if you've already picked it, or you could click insert if there's one that you have not pulled into here to be trying out. So for example, maybe I want to commit this one. Make sure that it worked. Hit play here. So now I've got my groove so neat. From here, all you need to do is click save as new song. So click on that and it will load up a new song. And then when you get this green bar, click go to song. It'll go into your library. And you've got the new song with our, for example, in mine, Groove So Neat right here. Let's make sure that it lined up and played correctly. All right, so there's a quick trick you can use to replace your lyrics, especially if you're running into errors or you're getting that grayed out match lyrics to audio feature. Now you've got another tool in your tool belt to get around that grayed out match lyrics to audio feature and hopefully get back to replacing your lyrics and saving you a lot of time and credits. If you found this video helpful, why don't you give it a like and subscribe if you love getting music AI how-to content. And until next time, this is Ken with CBAI. Thanks for watching, have fun creating and experimenting and take care.